Hello and welcome aboard the Hurricane Fun Deck 198 Outboard, one of the most fun and versatile boats on the water. Let's take a look. Let's take a look at the expansive forward deck on the 198 Outboard. Uh, plenty of real estate up here. Move around very easy on and off of this boat from the dock. Um, of course, the uh, Hurricane Fun Deck has the uh, a fiberglass hull, uh, the running surface, but it's got the uh, rails that we'll look at in a second, similar to a uh, to a pontoon boat. Uh, but with the deck boat design, with the fiberglass hull, that's going to run that uh, uh, full beam all the way forward. So you see that. Um, uh, you're not going to come to a, uh, a sharp point like you would on a regular sport boat uh, runabout style. Got a uh, non-skid uh, traction surface here on the uh, forward deck. Um, nice convenient anchor locker here. Just rest that right in there. We've got these uh, uh, integrated chafe guards here that are molded right in. That's going to help uh, keep the uh, anchor line, uh, get many more years of use out of it, uh, keep it from chafing. Also we've got this uh, a uh, stainless guide uh, for the anchor line built right in. And on windy days, a little breezy like we've got today, that's gonna help um, hold your boat in place. This boat is configured with a uh, optional fishing package. So you can see we've got two receivers for uh, pedestal seats uh, right here uh, mounted right up front. These are deluxe fishing chairs. Um, of course, they fold down uh, and safely latch when you're uh, transporting the boat or when you're underway from one part of the lake to the other. So if you fold that down, we've actually got a little extra storage here on this little uh, uh, basket on the back. We fold this up though, and we've got plenty of uh, plenty of room to uh, slide this boat, this um, chair back and forth, be able to fight fish all around the uh, this uh, forward area. Of course, you've got your fishing companion right here. Uh, just uh, a, a great setup uh, uh, for several folks to go out, uh, spend a day on the water, and enjoy part of that day uh, fishing. Another uh, giveaway sign that uh, this is a uh, fishing model is that we've got a really beautiful, large live well right here. Uh, easy access, of course, right to either one of the uh, forward fishing pedestal uh, chairs. This is a live well or bait well. It's aerated, controlled by switch right there on the helm. Uh, keep those uh, bait fish fresh uh, throughout the entire day. And of course, uh, it's gonna fold flat I mean, it's going to be very easy to uh, continue to walk around up here and just pop this hatch open whenever you need it. Stepping down into the uh, forward seating area, you can see uh, an expansive amount of room up here with that uh, full 8 foot 6 inch beam. Really plenty of room to walk around up here. Several folks uh, uh, moving forward and uh, aft in this boat. Uh, just very easy to get around. You can see there's a uh, molded step uh, down from that live well. Uh, makes it easy. Entrance is not a, uh, an overly long step or deep step uh, down in the cockpit. However, uh, you can see how deep this cockpit is. Um, uh, the deck is, uh, is much lower than the forward deck and it gives give you a, a nice uh, sense of uh, comfort and uh, stability and safety when you're up here. Uh, Fun Deck is really popular with folks who haven't boated before. Um, uh, among other groups, of course, but uh, one of the reasons they give is the, uh, the depth of the cockpit and the uh, rail system completely around the boat. Just gives them that nice sense that they're being uh, held in nicely and safely. Uh, step down, of course, we got an LED light here. It's gonna illuminate the uh, forward uh, seating area uh, in the evening. A 12-volt receptacle in case you want to put a, a trolling motor. Again, this is a fishing package, so that's going to be really convenient to the uh, to the uh, aerated live well there. Molded in uh, cup holders, uh, just like all uh, hurricanes. This boat, uh, whether it's a fishing package or not, this boat is designed for entertaining. So those cup holders are going to be really uh, choice real estate there. Um, coming into the uh, to the forward seating area, you can see a nice thickly padded back backrest. Those beautiful touches with the upholstery, the piping. Uh, it's just a very comfortable area up here. Also, uh, we've got a couple of um, uh, speakers for the stereo system. This has actually got a, uh, a Sony Marine radio on it. Um, new, in fact, for, uh, for this year. Uh, we can talk about it in a second, but the, uh, there's a Sony Bluetooth uh, option to uh, operate your, uh, your, uh, your music via your uh, cell phone. So we'll look at that in just a second. Just like with all hurricanes, this is uh, an incredible amount of storage on this boat. Uh, all your fenders, uh, dock lines, 
uh, can be stored in the forward area that's self-draining. Uh, it's got an identical uh, storage area on either side. So uh, one of the great things about uh, these boats is you're never going to have to feel like you're tripping over uh, your belongings during the course of a day. Another uh, great storage area here is this in-floor locker. Kind of tough to see from that angle, I know, but the, uh, it's very nicely finished, uh, very wide, uh, easy to uh, slide life jackets, uh, uh, tow ropes, uh, inflatables, anything you have uh, bring along for the day out on the water. Uh, very, very easy to take care of, clean. Um, just a really neat uh, feature. This is a, uh, a hydraulic assisted uh, door here, so you just pop that down, very smooth and easy, and then lock it back into place. This is the uh, sand dune carpet. This is a snap-in carpet option. Um, you'll notice that the carpet comes in uh, sections. Uh, that's uh, designed to be able to pull them out uh, individually if you need to just clean one certain area, or you could pop them all out, of course, uh, if you wanted to just wash the entire cockpit down. Um, that's so much easier than uh, having to manage a, uh, just a one giant piece of carpeting. And of course, it looks very nice, too. Again, that snap-in carpet just pops right on there. That's a nice upgrade. Moving over to the uh, front of the helm here, um, a nice uh, fishing feature here as well. We've got dedicated tackle storage. You don't see that a lot on a boat this size, but uh, what a nice touch to be able to have your uh, tackle right there. Um, you always know it's on the boat. You always know that's exactly where it is. You don't have to worry about uh, remembering that tackle box every single time if you've got your favorite lures and, uh, and hooks and everything you need right here. Convenient grab handle, again, uh, if folks haven't been out on the water very often, uh, it's always nice to give them a nice safe place to grip when they're moving uh, forward and aft in this boat. Over in the uh, midship area of the boat, we've got this convenient refreshment center. We've got a, a hidden uh, trash receptacle. Uh, anytime you're out on the water and you've got, uh, especially if kids are on board, uh, you always accumulate those wrappers and cans and things. Just put those right in here and that's going to close away. Simply empty it when you get back to the dock. A couple more of those uh, cup holders we talked about before, another grab handle, and plenty of extra storage under this uh, refreshment center. Moving back uh, to the uh, cockpit here, we can see we've got a beautiful uh, uh, wrap around uh, seating lounge here, a nice seating configuration. Again, those magnificent touches with the upholstery, uh, piping, tons more storage under all of these seat cushions. We've got a, a really nice uh, pedestal table, and that uh, triangle design is going to make it easy to position it uh, just so it's going to work perfectly for your guests, the way everything's laid out. A couple more recessed cup holders in there as well. Now let's take a look here on the uh, Bimini top. Uh, very stable aluminum frame design. You see that square design. Uh, extremely strong. Uh, looks really beautiful with that uh, kind of satin finish on it. Uh, hurricane uh, logo on the protective boot and the uh, new for the 2014 the boot is actually made out of the same material as the Bimini itself which means they're going to wear exactly the same way and they're going to be able to you're going to be able to clean them exactly the same way uh, again with that uh, beautiful uh, hurricane logo on there really helps uh, uh, with that uh, identity of the boat with the uh, fun deck hurricane take a look at the uh, helm on the fun deck 198 uh, you can see everything's beautifully laid out here. Uh, a nice uh, wood grain finish on the uh, instrument cluster here. Uh, high contrast uh, gauges, uh, uh, even the, uh, the, the motor trim gauge there. Uh, very easy to see, even in the sunlight here. Uh, we've got this uh, uh, smoked windscreen here that's going to just keep that uh, sun from blasting right down on your, uh, on your instruments. Also provides a little bit of wind protection if you're out uh, uh, in the early morning. We've got a uh, aftermarket Lowrance X4 Pro Fish Finder on here. Of course, uh, we got some other uh, fishing features that we've seen already. Uh, that's a really nice device, by the way, and an option on this boat. Got a uh, stainless cup holder here. All your switches right at your fingertips. Uh, a really nice soft touch steering wheel here. Very easy to get comfortable uh, when you're driving this boat. Uh, here's the uh, Sony Marine Radio we talked about before. This is an optional uh, radio with uh, Sirius XM. Uh, available. Uh, it's also got an auxiliary input so you can uh, uh, play your uh, iPod directly through it. Uh, more speakers down here, a molded in footrest, 
Uh, nice position for this uh, Honda outboard throttle we'll look at in a second uh, with the outboard. Uh, nice touches too with the um, uh, having the uh, padded side here. Uh, not only is it a beautiful design element, it really helps keep this uh, clean, but it's also just comfortable if you're walking along the side of the boat or leaning against the side of the boat or even have your arm up here. Uh, it's just really nice uh, to have that. Beautifully designed captain's chair, of course. Um, having these uh, raised bolsters on either side uh, is really going to give you that sensation that it's hugging you in the seat. Uh, also very easy to get comfortable with the uh, in and out of the seat with the uh, 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 of course, the, uh, the arms that, that go up, and we've got another uh, net behind this seat, too, uh, to hold your belongings, uh, keep them from uh, falling around when you're underway. Take a look now at the uh, aft deck of the Fun Deck uh, 198. You've got these uh, molded steps. Again, everything on this boat's really designed to uh, make you feel comfortable. So rather than have one longer step or higher step, uh, what a great idea to just make it a, a step down. Uh, just to make it easier to uh, get in the boat. Uh, again, that uh, non-skid surface on top, uh, even walking around back here so you have plenty of access to, uh, to the motor. We've got a, another one of those uh, fold-down boarding ladders, uh, gonna be very convenient. Just flip that down, telescopes, and uh, pull yourself right up into the boat, and then it just folds down neatly. Got uh, access to the uh, battery compartment here. A, uh, a really nicely designed ski tow bar. Um, this is going to help get that rope up and off of the uh, the top of the outboard. Uh, allow you to um, uh, pull wakeboarders or a skier or a, a knee boarder. Um, a very very strong stable design uh, bolted right to the uh, to the deck there. We've got a uh, Honda 115 horsepower outboard engine on this boat. The boat's actually rated up to 150 horsepower. And we've got a nice sun pad here. I don't want to block that from you, but the uh, uh, nice sun pad, again, that uh, soft touch vinyl. Uh, this can either uh, open up into a storage area. Uh, you can see that it's kind of open here, so you can uh, uh, put uh, towables and things like that in here. Or you get the optional pop-up changing room. Uh, be a nice area to get out of those wet clothes, help you spend more of your day on the water. Well, I really hope you enjoy this look at the extremely versatile and fun Hurricane Fun Deck 198 OB. Uh, not only is it a versatile, fun family boat, uh, also the ability to uh, really uh, shape this boat exactly how you want it by getting the different optional packages like that uh, incredible fishing option that we saw today. Till next time, this is Captain Steve.